Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to tie a French Prussic, which is also known as an auto block knot. Uh, it's a cousin of the regular Prussic knot and the Clem Heist, and is basically most often used by climbers as a rappel backup. So I'm going to show you how to tie it now with this 6mm accessory cord here. This is my preferred material. So I'm going to start by taking the loop around the rope, say a little bit off centre, so around about here. And I'm going to just start wrapping the accessory cord downward here. And how many wraps should we go for? Maybe three. I'll go for a fourth actually. Never hurts to have too many wraps. And let's squeeze that all together, just make it look nice and neat. And as you can see, I've got these two kind of tails here, which I'm going to put together. And then I'm going to go in with a locking carabiner, like so. And if this, if I was tying the French Prussic below my ATC, uh, below my blade device, I would clip this to my leg loop. And the thing about it is, when you're feeding rope through the belay device, you're lowering yourself down the crag. Um, if you, for whatever reason, decide to let go of the rope, something happens, you fall unconscious, you're hit by a rock or whatever, instead of the rope feeding through the belay device and you just continuing the rappel but in free fall, uh, the French Prussic will very conveniently lock, like so. And it's kind of basically a third hand on the rope, um, and that's why it's called a rappel backup. Um, the good thing is it slides very easily, okay, like so, but of course will always save you in the event of anything going wrong, like so. Now you may be wondering, well, we've done videos on a Prusik knot, we've done videos on the Klemheist knot, why are you showing us the French Prusik? The reason is, well, the French Prusik is most commonly preferred by climbers for rappel backup just because it slides easier and it doesn't quite strangle the rope as much as the regular Prusik. It doesn't quite choke the rope as much. So Prusiks and Clem heists are more for ascending the rope, uh, even though they can be used as rappel backups, but the French Prusik is more sort of casual. It's easier to manage um, and it's easier to tie as well. I mean, as you can see, it's just basically coiling the accessory cord around the rope. So there we go. There's your French Prusik auto block knot. Um, hope you found this video helpful. For more knots, uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out obsessionclimbing.com. Thanks for watching.